my ship, and I'm gonna try and shoot and see what happens. Okay. How do I shoot different things? Uh, what you do is you press for. So if you're in your ship, press T. Okay. T. Now you've got two things. So I've got the docking beam core and I've got a salvage computer, which in my case is seven eight seven. Now if I click on that and just press one, it, it doesn't give you any proper UI. Oh, I see. It is then bound to that. Okay. So you, if you've got multiple weapon systems, you then click yeah, on yeah, them yeah, with the mouse. It. it won't show you anything because the UI is a bit new, but it should then bind it. And then you can use like one and one for missiles, two for guns. There you go. Yeah, that's, that's a, a missile. missile. Where's it? Where's it going? Oh my god! What kind of missile did you buy? Uh, is it a homing missile? Is it a heat-seeking missile? Uh, Duncan, is it going to come back? I don't know. I think it's, it's coming back. What? Duncan, it's coming back. What it's coming homing back? on me. It's homing on me. <laughs> oh my god! Duncan! Oh, I can't do anything about Lewis, it! Lewis, run! Find a homing missile. Lewis. Run away! I'm, what do you think I'm doing? <laughs> <laughs> Duncan, you're a oh, damn reckless <laughs> maniac. Don't... Oh. It's going for the nearest heat source. It can't... It's going for my tree! <laughs> Where's it going now? I don't know, I think it's... it's like, have I shaken it? No, it's going for Ridge, I think. Oh, oh it's gone, it's gone. Gosh, oh, it must have it. detonated. Oh my god. Did it hit you, Ridge? <gasps> Are you okay? Um, I look okay. Well, there's got to be something we can use. I'm sure there is. As am I. Eating some cereal and making a mess. We don't have any bowls, oh, what you gonna do? Yeah! We'll try different cookie things like maybe a sieve And in a bit we'll try and use Bob shoe We'll blend it all together and see what we've got This song is pretty bad, I'm glad it didn't make the album Swallowing this shit like your motherfuckers do And here comes the guitar solo Better yet, you can improvise weapons with scavenged scissors, discarded cans, and sticky back plastic, like some kind of Blue Peter presenter gone wrong. Good morning, children. Today, we are going to be learning how to make your own survival weapon, using items scavenged from the post-apocalyptic world. Be warned, some of these items are a little bit sharp and dangerous, so be sure to have an adult help you with construction. To begin with, we have our base weapon, and we are going to begin by taping these scissors to them. It's a bit fiddly, but with a little bit of care, tape that onto the end. And you can even use the scissors. So that's the first part of our weapon. Here's one I made earlier. It's your mouth! Just, I'm a bit worried about, you know, personal space and everything. But oh my god! The mouths that you look you look like you're terrified. Like something scared you. Oh my god. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Minion. Thank you. Shake shake hands. <laughs> We definitely have to try this out, Uthgird. Uh, who can we try it out on? Or what? Can we just like blast these pots like against the wall? Is it is it gonna like send them flying big time? You ready for this, Uthgird? One, two, three. Did actually? Did you hear that crack of uh, 
that thunder crack that was kind of cool it's a, a, like a nice addition to the uh, to the old yelling fantastic all right great